Well, Carla Marcus Forest Green Rovers joining us on a season long loan from, from Hull. How does it feel to be down here at the new lawn? Yeah, no, it's good. Yeah, you, you come in and you just you just want to get going as soon as you get in. So we've had a couple of days now. Um, it's going to be tough, I know that, but yeah, I'm ready. And how's the move all come about from your perspective? Yeah, just as the club speak, um, and then my agent contacts me. It's had a conversation with or two with the gaffer. He's sharing his ideas. We we had a good chat, to be fair. Um, he tells me his plan for me for the club, and yeah, I I just just think it's going to go in the right direction this season from obviously um, my perspective I just want to play as much as I can and just do well for, for the club yeah. Um, you mentioned briefly those conversations with, with Duncan, how did you find him over the phone as a, as a future head coach for yourself? Yeah no he's, he's full of jokes I think, um, he he's a, seems really genuine and He's excited about the football club, I think. Um, obviously, he wants to do the right things. He wants to play the right way. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to working with him. Just tell us a little bit about yourself as a player, Callum. What, what can Forest Green fans expect to see? Um, hopefully, get on the ball as much as I can. Um, try and dictate the play. Get in amongst it. I understand it's a tough league. Um, you need that physical side. So, hopefully, I can bring a physical presence in the middle of the park. Contribute as well with... Uh, Assists, goals, I, ho I hope. <laughs> um, yeah, so we can be successful. And just talk to us a, a little bit about the experiences you've had so far, I guess. You know, a number of first team appearances for Hull, the, the loan spell at Morecambe as well, which was a, su a successful one for you. Tell us a little bit about, about those experiences. Yeah, yeah, I played a few games for Hull um, and got myself a loan move to Morecambe. Um, I think we had a successful season. Uh, I enjoyed it when I was playing. I found it difficult at times, but I think I learned a lot. So as a player, I think I've grown since then. So hopefully I can bring more here to to show than what I did at Morecambe with everything that I learned on and off the pitch when I was there. Um, from whole side of things, I think obviously been a lot of change recently um, and it's been positive also. It's developed me as a player. So again, I hope I can bring that here and show showcase it here. Yeah. And the benefit for you, I guess, is you've already had a couple of days, haven't you, with the lads you've been in, in with testing? How have you found the, the couple of days so far? Yeah, it's always intense, um, long couple of days, but um, I'm, I'm excited to, to get the testing out of the way, get the balls out, get the games going and see what we can do as a group. How beneficial is it for you to, to come in while there's still basically the whole of pre-season left as well, rather than this being a, a late sort of deadline day move or something yeah, like that? Yeah, I think when me and the gaffer spoke, it was one of the things that I stressed. I wanted to come in day one and, and um, share his ideas and the ideas he puts across to the players. I wanted to be involved because it's hard when you're playing catch-up. Um, being involved from day one, bonding with the lads, uh, just building that relationship early doors so in four or five weeks when the game in the league starts, I think you've, you've got that bond and you, you understand each other well, so I think it's really important. You mentioned that you want to get on the, the ball as much as possible and, you know, certainly towards the end of last season, Dunk's team dominated the ball and I suppose that's going to suit you down to a tee, isn't it? Yeah, that was a big factor again in, in coming with the manager. He said to me about he wants his team to dominate the ball and he wants you to be fearless and, and get on the ball and, and show what you can do. I think it's it's enjoyable when you've got the ball. Um, you're going to make mistakes, granted, I think, but when you've got the ball, you can you can have fun. You, you're trying to create things, um, and being on the front foot is important in a game, I think, yeah. Just finally, Callum, you've chosen your number already. Yeah. Uh, chose it yesterday, I think. Number 28 you've gone with. Just explain to us a little bit about that. Yeah, so last year, unfortunately, I lost my granddad which was my best mate, so I think his birthday is the 28 um, number. So I think I just want to carry him with me all the time. Uh, know that he's, he's with me and yeah, I'll, I'll be fine on the pitch.